Hey everyone, my name is James and welcome back to Antiaris. So it's day six and I had a little bit of a different plan for today's episode, but I actually can't do it the way I wanted to do it because in today's episode, I really wanted to have a look at the brand new boss in Antiaris because I know a lot of you are very excited to see it because this mod only actually has one new boss. That's it. You know, we're so used to like Calamity and Forium having, you know, you know, 15 or, you know, 10 or even like five bosses. Well, this one only has one so far. And I don't know if there are going to be any others. Um, I really don't know. Uh, I tried not to read up on anything, honestly, so that I could enjoy this experience just as it is. Um, but yeah, that's that's the case. It's only got one. So the plan was to cover it today. But the only problem is, is you can't actually do it until you've beaten Queen B, apparently. Uh, this was actually something I was unaware of. Okay, there's that. Um, so I thought what we could do is we could beat Queen B or give it a go. Um, and then what we'll do is we'll give the new modded boss a try, right? And we'll see if we can beat it. But yeah, like, like I said, I wanted to start the episode with this new boss. And I'll be honest, I actually did record this episode already. Uh, but I had different plans for the original recording and it didn't go to plan. And I thought, you know what, I could do this just a little bit better. So I thought, I'll make an episode, and I'll put it out a little bit later, and it'll be better. It'll be better because of it. So this is what you get. <laughs> um, I'm going to do an arena for the Queen Bee. Uh, I'm not very good at the Queen Bee. You may have learned this during uh, the Christmas series, because I think I, I had problems with it in the Christmas series. Uh, I also had problems with it in uh, the Spirit Mod series. Because I'm honestly not very good with the Queen Bee, and I never have been. It's one boss that basically uh, slips away from me. But let's spawn it, and we'll see how we do. Uh, we've got some accessories that have been reforged, and that's it. <laughs> okay, let's see. See, I've gone quiet now because I'm, I'm nervous about beating it. But I hope you've all been well. Thank you for leaving your New Year's resolutions with me. Uh, for every person that left one, I feel like there was an equal person that was like, well, I don't really do them. Um, but that, So that was interesting to read. Uh, it's kind of a lot of people were a lot like me in that sense, because obviously, as I mentioned yesterday, I don't do them. Uh, not to be cool or anything. It's just that I, uh, I well, I'm lazy. <laughs> and I also live day by day. So I don't really see it as a, as a big thing. But a lot of people do. So there's that. Um, and there were some good ones. I saw some good ones. A Be a better friend was one. I thought that was quite sweet. Um, one person was like, my friend moved away recently, so I want to talk to him more, and I thought that was quite quite noble. Um, and then I saw a lot of people say, I want to be a better student. Uh, a lot of people like, I want to start a YouTube channel this year, which, which is cool. I recommend it. Um, I also saw people that were like, I want to watch more YouTube. You know, I guess that's kind of mad goals really to have. I mean, I, I, you know, I, I think I watch enough of YouTube for, for a lifetime. I think I've got everyone covered, and I have done for years. So that was nice. It was, it was good to read all of those. And, uh, yeah, you know, eh, you know, there were some, there were some usuals as well, like, I want to uh, go to the gym, as I mentioned yesterday. Uh, I think that could benefit me. Why not? So kind of cool. My health is low. Look at that. I only have a few seconds left on the heal, though. Uh, okay. This is going better than expected, but I'm losing a lot of health. I didn't expect to, I'll be honest, I didn't expect to lose as much health as I'm losing. Like, I feel like everything is hitting me. Like, usually, this fight has a section where it stops and spawns a few bees, but it didn't. I'm so glad I beat that, because I was so sure I was going to lose. I was rambling away like, any minute now, James, get ready. <laughs> You're about to get killed by a bee. Oh, nice. There we go. So that's done. So that means we can now do... Oh my god! I'm getting the rarest things in this mod. Look at that! The honeyed goggles. Do you know how rare they are? Very rare. Very rare. It's weird how rare they are. Why are they so rare? But they are. Um, <laughs> and I got... What else did I get? I got the binoculars. They're extremely rare. Oh my god. Do you know I just realised? Do you know just dawned on me? My past two I have Cthulhu kills have both given me the binoculars. I got one at the Jingle Jam, which was my live stream with the Yogg's cast. And I've got one now. What on earth is this? What is that? I can't, I can't believe that. That's insane. Um, I also built, off camera and in the original episode, I built uh, more NPC houses. So we have double the amount. 
so that we could get all the NPCs from the Alchemy mod and we could bring back our one from uh, the Antiaris mod. I built a Helevator. I did that off camera. I've got an arena for Skeletron, which we might do today. You know what? We probably will do Skeletron today. I don't know if we'll win, but you know what? I'll give it a really good go. And there we go. That's that's it. Whew. So let's check out this new uh, this new doll. This new antlion doll. What's the boss called? The antlion queen? Um, I actually turned up the music for today's episode. Not by request, but because I hear that there's new music. And I really, really like modded music. It's a big thing for me. Music in a, in a mod uh, can really make a mod. And I want to see what this boss is like. Like I said, it's only got one boss. So I'm really kind of hoping it's good. I'm not going to lie. Because I've really had fun with this... Uh, this mod. And I don't know how far to take this series, so I may need some help with that, but I'm just going to keep playing until I get bored. And I don't think I'm going to get bored for a while, because I'm really enjoying the charm of having little things dotted through Terraria, and I think that's because I did a vanilla series last month. So I'm appreciating that. Anyway, let's get into this, uh, let's get into this. Please be good. Puff up. Begin. Ant Lion Queen. Okay, I'm already liking the music. <laughs> what is that? That is sick. That's a decent sprite, and I'll give you that. It's looking pretty original compared to some of the other ones that you get. Oh, it's a giant one of these. You know, I didn't even pick up on that. I thought it was just like a uh, an original concept. Right, I'm going to be honest, right? We may need to fix the, the glitching. But, Antiaris, I'm going to let you off. But you also did make Tremor, so I know you know how to make bosses. <laughs> but I'm joking, don't worry. Uh, this is cool. I do like the music. So, uh, so that's a plus. And I'm trying not to get stuck to this, but I'm doing my best. It's cool because it adds to the desert, which obviously... Whoa! No way. That was cool. <laughs> this, is, this is pretty sick. Oh, do you know what I want to be using? I want to be using this. Is this going to be any better for me? It probably is, right? Uh, okay. Uh, God, I ain't got much health. <laughs> are the bees even doing out? I don't feel like they are. I'm going to try set it on fire real quick. Yeah, I don't know if uh, this was maybe doing better. I'm, oh, I'm so low on health. Uh, <laughs> can you take it out the biome? I don't want to, I don't want to make it lose. <laughs> oh, I dropped the silk scarf. Really? That's something I crafted earlier. That is sick. I like that. You gave me a good laugh for that, Antiaris. You did. You gave me a good laugh for that. <laughs> oh, that's good. You need to fix the glitching, but I like it. I like it. That's <laughs> it's not bad. Oh, wow. Wow, that was interesting. <laughs> I'm still getting over it. It was unique in a way. <laughs> It was pretty goofy at the same time, and I won't lie about that. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to throw me into the air as well. I thought that was a nice little touch. I thought the uh, the little sandstorms were cool as well. They obviously gave you uh, extra damage. Well, they gave me extra damage. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, that was that was that was interesting. That was interesting. Right. Okay. So I know I said I was going to do Skeletron. I, I might have said that. I don't know. I get all disjointed when I record because I forget everything that I say. A few seconds after I say it, because I'm coming up with new things as we go along. Sometimes I get really fast, and I say things that are dumb. Um, I got a comment that was like, check the skies, friend. So I don't know if that means Martians, maybe. Or if I'm meant to check my sky islands. So we'll see. So I got one that had a shiny red balloon in it. I used it to make an accessory. Uh, I also found the goblin. So filling you up on that one. Uh, I found the goblin. He's a, a friend of mine now. So that was decent. I'm going to zoom out. Whoa! So we can see any floating islands. And then I'm trying to think of what else I did. I tried to make today as productive as possible in terms of the series. Like I wanted to I wanted to build new things and find new things and get accessories. I didn't get all the accessories I wanted, sadly. I did want some Hermes boots. I didn't get Hermes boots, sadly. Okay, still checking out the sky. Haven't found anything so far. So this comment could be absolutely uh, a waste of time. Who knows? But I, I trust I trust the comments in that sense. I trust you guys to uh, to guide me in the right direction. I also... Oh, I also got a banging comment that made me laugh. 
Somebody was like, I miss Hello Terraria Enthusiast. I'll tell you why I got rid of it and why I bring it back every now and again. What is that? What is that? What is it? Oh, it's a, it's a thing following me. It's <laughs> it looks like Casper the Ghost. Is that something that happens to all harpies or... Interesting. Uh, I got a comment that was, yeah, the Hello Terraria Enthusiast. I'll tell you why I got rid of it. When I record... And I belt out a large Hello Terraria Enthusiast. Well, sometimes, and I'll let you into some movie magic. Sometimes the first recording you see isn't always the first one. Because I get like, sometimes I'll like stumble over myself in the first five minutes. I'm like, I'll change this. I'll, I'll redo this. So belting out too many Hello Terraria Enthusiasts really kind of hurts my throat. So usually, uh, I'm trying to say I get rid of it. <laughs> there we go. And in series where I want there to be like a more calmer mood, like Antiaris, drop it. <laughs> okay, I don't see anything new yet, but I'm going to carry on because I have my feelings that there will be something new. So I've got 30 seconds on this one. Maybe, see, I want to do a jump cut. I'll be honest, because I don't want to waste your time. I do want to do a jump cut, but then I'm also like, well, what if I find something cool? I want, I want to show my first reactions to it. And then what we can do is, see, we can play a gamble here, right? The gamble is this. If I find nothing, I'll cut this out, and you won't even see it. So if you're listening to this, you know that something good is coming eventually. And you're all going to be witness to it. Um, I can't imagine it being over the ocean, but we'll see. Oh. 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 Oh! <laughs> Oh, if I was only one second faster. <laughs> Just one. God. Jesus. Right, okay. Well, let's go the other way. Okay, so if you're watching this, you know something good's coming. I do not yet. So we're going to see. Uh... Hurry it up, though, man. If there is anything new, come on. It's my New Year's resolution to make more jump cuts. <laughs> no, it's not really. <laughs> I think we make a good amount of jump cuts. I used to get a lot of comments back in a uh, back in the day that I did too many, and uh, and when I would go so this is some old YouTubers. Do, I'll be honest with you. When I googled my name, I used to find people talking about me on message boards and stuff like that, like Reddit and. And the Terraria forums, and they would say something along the lines of, uh, Oh, I like Chippy, but he does too many jump cuts, so I don't watch him. Oh. Hey, 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 there we go. Oh. Well, that was very cruel of you. Why'd you do that? Uh, does that one set you on fire too? Really? But why? Why, why do that? Is there any, is there any kind of, a? Uh, that's literally it? Very mean. Alright, so this is what's new, I'm guessing. Thank you to the commenter. I appreciate it. <laughs> I do. What is this? Sandstorm Boots Equiptable. Allows to do long controllable jumps by holding the jump button. Grants immunity to Sandstorm Wind. Oh my god, that would have been perfect during the last fight. Increases defense when player stands on sand. Oh my god. This literally could have been an absolute lifesaver in the last one. Oh, and we also got these. I need to talk about these. Enchanted Chants. Oh, my God. There's a story there. Oh, and it's right above the desert. Oh, my God. So, there you go. I didn't know about it, so I lost out. All right, so what's the... What's it let you do? Oh, it's like... Sandstorm... Whoa. That's pretty mad. God, that goes so far. Does it go far in the desert or other places as well? So if you hold it in... Oh, that's really, really cool. I wish... Could you imagine if we'd found that at the start, knowing the mod? That could have been really, really awesome. Wow, I like that. That's that's Honestly, that's sick. Oh, what was I talking about? Oh, I lost my... Tr oh, there we go. Victory shards or whatever. They look like victory shards from whatever mod. These, so this is the gem that we couldn't mine until we got the uh, Demonite pickaxe. And I actually did get some to try out because I was like, well, I want to have a look at them. Um, and they make an upgrade to the gold armor. And uh, do you know what? I can't be bothered with that. That seems like 
to a little bit of a wasted potential for something that's locked away behind a boss progression because people like me don't make golden armor it takes forever and you need rubies and you need uh, sapphires to make it as well and they don't come cheap so i left it behind but anyway that is going to do it for today's episode i appreciate you watching uh tomorrow we're going to do skeletron um i was going to do it today and then i i, I kind of like midway through this episode i was like i would lose i would lose that fight so we'll end it there right thank you all for watching i really appreciate it if you do want to leave a like i would appreciate that too um i like killing these robbers here they come at night sometimes because sometimes they give you robbers bags and they also give you leather and leather's a real hard thing to make. It's, it's, they use a lot of rotten chunks for it. Oh my god, that accessory is awesome. Okay, we'll end it there. Have a fantastic day, everyone. I'll see you all tomorrow. And uh, peace.